Today's video is brought to you by Technically Not a Technician, and in today's video we'll take a look inside the unpacked Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles .apk file to see Arcade 1UP's little dark secrets. As you can see we're at the root of my drive, and in front of us are four items I wish to point out. First is an unchanged Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles APK file. The second is an executable tool simply called APK tool. The third, a batch file with the same title as the executable, and the last is a folder titled TMNT. In short, I used the batch file and executable together to extract everything from the APK file to the folder titled TMNT on the root of my drive. Inside the unpacked APK we looked around and found a few interesting things. As I'm sure you can hear the background menu music is one of the items that we've found, in the very first folder that we looked at. We also found a few test and error sounds that all seem to be the same high-pitched noise. The items that I've found interesting are inside the RES folder. If we enter into this folder and we make our way to the folder titled RAW we'll find 10 zipped files. Two of these zipped files have names similar to Crime Fighters, and if you're unaware Vendetta was intended to be a sequel for the first Crime Fighters, that was released only in Japan. If you open each ROM you can see what looks to me like MAME files. I've got to ask the question, where did they get these files, and are these ROMs taken from MAME ROM sets? As stated you do have two zipped folders that look as if they have names similar to Crime Fighters, and we presume they're ROMs, but we also have eight other zip folders of different file sizes, with the smallest being that of the zip file ending in 740. I'm guessing the smaller zip ending in 740 is a placeholder, and that is why this size is smaller, and yes that's just a wild ass guess and nothing more. However, it does seem to fall in line. I did see that some of these ROMs are easy to identify, as what game they go to, because the .nv file, a MAME file extension that is sometimes needed to save high scores, are inside the zip and named after the game the ROM goes to. This got me curious about the other files in each of these zipped folders. I don't know if any of you in YouTube land have ever looked inside your MAME ROMs, but the items I see inside each of these zipped folders, look like the same as those found in MAME ROMs. What I believe is they are the same files, as found inside each ROM in your main ROM set, I'm also guessing if they are, I should be able to Google each file by name and get back ROM data from a known main arcade ROM. So armed with that idea, I copied the name of the first file in one of the unmarked ROMs, and I pasted it into Google, with the keyword MAME. The very first result in my Google search is a reference to the MAME set of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles and its .cpp file. So I believe we can say looking at this early on shows Arcade 1UP is using main naming conventions at the very least, and I'm betting that if you check the CRC and check sums they'd be the same as in the main ROM sets. I've also noticed that many of the menu, background, and navigation sounds seem to be in very standard file formats. If I was a bit braver I'd replace some of the sounds and try my hand at repacking the APK. I've never done this, but heard it can be done. I'd like to thank you for checking out this video. I hope you've enjoyed it, and found it informative. Please remember to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video with a friend. Oh, shell shock.